Alyssa Bustamante. 15-year-old Alyssa Bustamante was the product of a terrible childhood. She was abandoned by her alcoholic mother as a baby and repeatedly molested by her father when he wasn't in jail. Bustamante was left with severe social issues and displayed signs of bulimia, self-harm, and had attempted suicide at only 13. In October 2009, the troubled teen dug two graves in the woodland by her house before luring nine-year-old Elizabeth Olton to her doom. The young killer strangled and stabbed her victim before slitting her throat with a kitchen knife. She later wrote in her diary that she had just f***ing killed someone and that it felt amazing. When confronted by police, Bustamante quickly confessed to the killing and led them to where the body was buried. Bustamante was sentenced to life in prison with the possibility of parole after 35 years. In subsequent hearings and after years of counseling, Alyssa has apologized to the victim's family, saying that, if I could give my life to bring her back, I would. I just want to say I'm sorry for what happened. I'm so sorry. Alyssa is eligible for parole in 2047. She will be 53 years old. Thanks for joining us on this epic journey of killer kids. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to let us know by liking this video and leaving a comment below. If you can't get enough of capital, be sure to check out one of these other videos. Finally, before you go, make sure to subscribe to our channel, turn on the notifications, and be a part of our awesome community. Catch you next time, killers!